uh, jaw-dropping report from the Economic Policy Institute, uh, EPI dot uh, whatever it is, uh, you'll have to look it up. Um, they found that uh, CEO pay from 1978 to 2022 went up 1,209.2%. 1,209% CEO pay from 1978 to 2022. Now, why would that be? Of course, because uh, Ronald Reagan and then George W. Bush and then Donald Trump all reduced taxes on the CEO class. And also Reagan uh, changed the regulations around stock buybacks, uh, which used to be very, very heavily regulated and now are just like, hey, you know, it's free for all. And uh, the result of that is that CEOs are making a bloody fortune and uh, average working people are out in the cold. So anyhow, that the CEO pay went up 1,209%, whereas the average worker's pay during that same period of time from 1978 to 2022 went up 15.3%. So what we're seeing is that uh, the, now today, the average CEO in an S&P 500 company makes more in one day than their workers make in an entire year which would be more than, what, 365 to 1? Uh, the median, just in the, last, uh, in the last 12 months, median compensation of chief executives at major U.S. listed firms increased from 12 point, uh, by 12.6%. Now, the average worker in the United States is getting a raise. We've seen this, you know, and this is in large part because President Biden has been encouraging unionization uh, and that sort of thing. The average worker pay went up by 4.1% last year, uh, according to the U.S. Department of Labor. Uh, but uh, CEO pay in the last year went up 12.6% from 16.3 million, or excuse me, to 16.3 million on average in 2023. Nice work if you can get it. 16 million bucks, that's, uh, what, that's about a million dollars every three weeks, roughly? Can you imagine every three weeks opening your bank statement and seeing that an additional million dollars just got added? Million dollars? That would mean that every week you'd be depositing about $300,000, if I'm doing the math in my head right, uh, it'd be about $300,000 every week in your, in your bank account being added, uh, which would be, you know, a five-day week, um, uh, what would that be, about $60,000 a day? Again, I'm, I'm not good at math in my head. I don't, don't take my numbers to the bank, but that's a lot of money. I, don't, I, I just don't see why anybody or how anybody is worth that kind of money. I, you know, I get it if somebody starts a company, you know, Jeff Bezos, uh, it, it kind of thing, you know, with Amazon, um, that you know, over time the company grows in part because of their efforts and, you know, the value of their stock, the value of their ownership of that company increases. I, you know, I get that. But just somebody who's been hired to be the CEO of a company, there's no shortage of people who have good skills, who are very talented, who've been to business school or just have good business sense. It's, it's just, uh, you know, it's, it's like this has become cartelized, this whole, you know, let's, let's be a CEO and get massively rich.